Hello guys and welcome back to Pesh Entertainment. So today I'm going to check out one of the most awaited Bollywood movie of 2023. This is Adi Purush directed by Omrod and we have a pan-Indian star Prabhas, Saif Ali Khan and Kirti Sanon. So this is supposed to be based on the Ramayana story. It's an epic Hindu uh, mythological story. Omrod directed uh, Tanaji um, a couple of years ago and I fairly enjoyed the movie. So the fact that he collaborated with Prabhas uh, created a huge uh, expectation. And uh, to be honest, when they announced this film, I thought it was going to be a live action film. And uh, it turned out that this teaser uh, revealed that this is going to be a mixture of motion capture and animated uh, in this film. So without wasting any more time guys, let's check out uh, Adi Purush uh, Hindi teaser. Let's go, let's do this. Prabhas. Saif Ali Khan Get the sun on. Adi Purush. Alright guys, so I'm going to try to give my honest opinion about uh, Adi Poro's teaser. Uh, visually, it looks good. <laughs> Seriously. We can see that this is a pure animation movie. It's not a live action film, but for some reason it feels like uh, the faces are realistic, but everything else were all CGI and visual effects. So I think they're really relying a lot on visual effects and CGI, and this is an animated movie. I heard this movie was made on a budget of 500 crore. Really? 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 To be honest, when they announced this movie of Adi Purush, I think it was like a year ago during uh, the COVID uh, period, uh, I was expecting to be a live action film, like a war epic uh, movie based on the story of Ramayana. And uh, there was a couple of making of uh, steel that came out of Adi Purush. And at the same time, also Prabhas announced a couple of other movies, uh, such as uh, Salar and Project K. So I was thinking, if they're making a big movie uh, of this grandeur, Adi Purush, with a huge budget of 500 crore, I was, about, I was a bit skeptical because I was wondering how is he going to do other movies at the same time? What's, what's the reason for him to announce uh, other projects? Is he not really caring about Adi Purush? Uh, so it turned out the movie was shot in a couple of months. I think they shot probably like in four or five months and everything was done uh, as a motion capture. So there was already a movie, uh, animated movie um, that uses the motion capture technology uh, back in, I think, 2014. Uh, this was the movie from Superstar Rajini Khan in Tamil called Kocha Dayan. So Kocha Dayan is a movie that I watched uh, personally. The animation was really bad to be honest. I mean it was a good attempt but the animation overall the output of Kocha Dayan was really really bad. Um, it failed to live up uh, to all the expectations that they were trying to create in Kocha Dayan. But story-wise it was good. I think the story, the emotion uh, was really good, but because it was animated, uh, it failed to create uh, an impact emotionally, so you couldn't feel really connected with the characters. But overall, Coach at the end, he had a great music, 
um, the acting wasn't great because it's all animated, but the story was really good. I really enjoyed the story. So when it comes to Adi Purush, I can feel that the story is going to be epic. It's based on uh, Ramayana. So we have um, Prabhas playing the um, Lord Ram, and then we have Kirti Sana, I think she's uh, Sita, I believe, and then we have Salik Saif Ali Khan playing uh, Ravana, and then we also have uh, Anuman, and then we got a lot of uh, mythic uh, creatures because this is based on the on the Hindu mythology. So there's going to be a lot of Hindu uh, mythical creatures and story, etc., 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 and love stuff going on. So this story itself is grand and epic, and everyone can enjoy it. But when it comes to execution and direction, I don't know why Omro decided to make this movie into uh, a fully animated film. And I think this is quite deceiving because, to be honest, I don't recall him announcing the movie to be fully animated. Uh, everyone expecting this one to be a, a live action film. Um, uh, there was a couple of pictures, like I said, of a motion picture of them uh, with a motion uh, capture suit. Uh, so I was, I, I don't know, to be honest, um, I, 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 I won't say I'm disappointed, I was expecting something else. So, uh, in terms of the teaser itself, it was very well cut, the, the music is good, uh, we can see Prabhas is back. But I think, to be honest, uh, we were expecting something else. Uh, Tanaji was a, was a decent film, uh, it was fairly engaging, um, it, was, it was very well executed as a live action film. Uh, it was starring Ajay Devgan, so Omrud has such a great potential to make a big budget epic film. So, Adi Purush, I don't know guys, uh, uh, I don't know what to say about this teaser. It was good in the sense of as an animated film is going to be good, but I think a lot of people are going to be disappointed because you make uh, such a great grand movie of this big budget and the output is not really good because a lot, there's a lot of movie that comes out with great animation, with great visual effects. So there's going to be a loads and loads of a comparison with other movies, especially from Hollywood and even India. And this is supposed to be a pan-Indian film. And the selection uh, of Prabhas uh, upcoming movies are not really good. I think it needs to be a, little, be a bit more selective because he's a pan-Indian star. And after Barbali, he hasn't made any good movie in the recent times. Saho was disappointing, Radishian was disappointing. So I don't know what he's trying to do. I know he, I know he's got a lot of pressure to make a big big scale movies and um, uh, Saho was disappointing and he did not deliver. Uh, Radishyam had so much potential but again failed as a, as a film and I don't know about Adi Purush, a lot of people are going to watch it because it's going to be uh, a visual spectacle but it is an animated movie and the output is not really good, it's not great. Uh, I felt like they could have made it into a live action film rather than sticking to an animated film because a lot of people are going to be disappointed in terms of animation, CGI and visual effects. Um, but the story itself of the Ramayana story is going to be epic, it's going to be engaging and hopefully our home route uh, will have a great screenplay and make us connected with these characters uh, and their journey and about this Hindu mythology. To be honest, uh, Prabhas needs to be a little bit more cautious when it comes to selecting a great script because he's got so much pressure on his shoulder and a lot of fans of him are expecting big film like Baobali. So he cannot rely too much on certain directors because now uh, this is actually a Bollywood film uh, which stars a, a big Telugu actor but he's also a pan-Indian star now. When they announced Adi Purush, I know something was not going right. Something was not going right and uh, the teaser is not disappointing but it's about the expectation. Everybody was expecting something else and the output is something else and not something that we were expecting uh, from this team of uh, Adi Purush. But definitely Omrut uh, will improve in terms of uh, CGI and visual effects. I'm trying to be positive to be honest. I don't want to be too negative and critical about Adi Purush. I do have hope for this film, but it's coming out on uh, January the 12th in multiple languages. It's also coming out in 3D and IMAX. I think this movie will do well for the children. I think it's more oriented for the family and children, but for hardcore, for hardcore fan of cinema lovers, they might be a little bit disappointed. I know Prabhas fan will enjoy this film, but the output, I don't know. We have to see when the movie comes out. We have to keep our expectation low because if you have so much expectation for this film already, a lot of people have mixed, mixed reviews and there is a lot of uh, negative reviews going on on social media. So yeah, let's see what it's about when it comes out in cinema on January the 12th. I'm gonna keep my expectation low and see what Omrut is going to do with this film. So that's all guys. So that's my reaction and review to Adi Purush uh, Hindi teaser. Let me know what you guys think about this teaser. Put it in the comment below. And as always, if you enjoyed my reaction and review, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and do not forget to turn on notification bell and follow me on Twitter and for now, Ishiboy Harry. And I'm out.